here's an interesting question. What do you think of aggressive vegan YouTubers claiming to be superior to meat eaters and saying that non-vegans don't deserve to live? I'm not naming any names, but I'm really curious to know your opinion on all those vegan haters out there. By the way, I think you're awesome and keep it up. That's from Judy. Well, whoever is out there, and I know that they are out there, but I've never watched them because I have no, ain't nobody got time for that. That's absolute horse shit and it's insane. Um, first of all, what right do you have to say that? You don't, you're cruel and you're rude and you have a fucking, um, what's it called? Uh, what is I'm trying to say? You have a pole stuck up your ass. That's not what I'm trying to say, but like, nobody's better than anybody for the decisions that they make. And I just, I don't really want to comment on this because I just think it's absolute madness if you're that kind of person. And I don't think that anyone who's contemplating being vegan should take those people as the norm. I think there is a really big movement of cool uh, people trying to change the fact that the vegan community can be very judgmental, which defeats the entire purpose of the whole thing anyways. Um, so please, if you're like contemplating being vegan and you're afraid about talking about being vegan because you're afraid of the way people are going to perceive you, just don't let that affect your decision and make the decision to go vegan because you know it's best for you and then be part of the cool team that's all here just trying to live their lives by doing what's best for them, knowing other people will follow suit based on influence. Not because I'm bullying you and telling you and scaring you and freaking you out into becoming vegan for any one of the above reasons all of these people mention. Like, at the end of the day, I honestly don't really care what you do. You can do whatever you want. I mean, I can't tell you what to do. I have no right to tell you what to do or to tell you that anything I'm doing is better than what you're doing. But I know what's right for me and I'm doing it. And by doing it and sharing it and talking about it in like just a normal way, people are being influenced. But I don't expect everybody that watches this channel or listens to me to be like, oh, I better go vegan now. Um, I think what's been happening ever since talking about being vegan more, which I think has been more beneficial than it has been negative for me, even though before I was afraid to do that simply for the negative reasons, what's happened is that it's made me just realize, it's made me like chill out a lot more about the whole vegan thing. Like, yeah, I have a whole vegan channel called Hot For Food and I talk about vegan food, but I'm not like doing it because I think that every time I put out a recipe, like the whole world's gonna fucking go off tilt and change. Like it's a total work in progress. And I think there's a lot of great information out there and watching a documentary like Cowspiracy, I think is really important for everybody to watch at this point in time based on the way our planet is going. But at the end of the day, you're also gonna do what you're gonna do. And I don't really care what you do because for every person who doesn't go vegan, there will be many people that do go vegan. And I think eventually you're just gonna be forced to go vegan, as I've said before, because meat's gonna to be too expensive or it's altogether just gonna stop being manufactured. So I'm not even worried about it. Here's the thing, I'm not even worried. I'm not even worried if you decide to go vegan or not because you're gonna be forced to go vegan at the end of the day. <laughs> um, I mean, that's just kind of what I think is gonna happen. I could be wrong, obviously I might be wrong, um, but I just, just, I just don't want to be lumped into this group of people that is like fighting. I've, sa I've said this before. I just don't think it's the right approach. So I don't want to be part of that group. I try to avoid, you know, being lumped into like, I, I don't want to say I avoid being lumped into the vegan community. Obviously I'm part of the vegan community and there's lots of different types of vegans and we're all great and we're all doing great stuff. But here's the thing. This is not a vegan channel. And I am not just a vegan who's on a vegan mission that, that eats vegan food and buys vegan things. Like, it's only one part of who I am. And so I think what tends to happen when you say you're vegan is you somehow just get taken out of here, out of regular society and lumped over here into this vegan place over here. And I'm really just trying to make it like, no, this doesn't exist and this doesn't exist. It's just all here and we're all harmoniously here and we're all doing different things and we're all trying to understand each other and it's all fine and it's all good and whatever you wanna do is whatever you wanna do. 
So I guess I'm just being very general about it because I think that's the only way you can be. And I don't want to exhaust myself trying to fight and tell people what to do and say this is the way and that's not the way and blah, blah, blah. I think there are other people out there who can do that better than me and let those people be those people. But I'm not going to be that person and that's just me. If you're watching channels where they're saying that you're an awful person and you deserve to die because you're not vegan, please unsubscribe from those channels. Why are you watching those? Why do you think that? Why do you think that you are somehow better than anybody else? You're not. These people just haven't learned. They just haven't experienced something yet or whatever. It doesn't mean that you're better. It doesn't mean that they might one day get there and become vegan and then what? Oh, you said they deserve to die because they didn't become vegan soon enough. It's like, it doesn't matter. Okay, anyways. Just don't watch those people. Those, I think that's insanity. So that's what I think. And um, I am vegan, but I'm also just a person and I like lots of other things. And I just don't also want people to think that what I'm doing here on YouTube, here on this channel is like a vegan channel. I don't want this to become a vegan channel where every video is about like this topic and that topic and this vitamin and this thing and that, cause I'm not doing that because I'm not an expert because I'm just doing what I'm doing and I'm just sharing what I'm doing and I'm sharing from all aspects of my life, as you've seen my cat and my boyfriend and my house and my trips and shopping and everything. It's like, just because I'm vegan doesn't mean I don't shop. And just because I'm vegan doesn't mean I don't whatever, you know, it's like all these different things. It's like, we're not all the same. We don't all like the same things. So I'm going to leave it at that right now before I, again, exhaust my energy, which I don't want to do. <laughs> but thank you for the question, Judy. And I'm not getting mad at you. You just brought up an interesting topic. So thank you for that. Cause I think it is an interesting topic.